An interest group has said only a, a huge commitment to the community, but yeah, to the community sector would enhance a peaceful, habitable uh, environment for all. So this is the group called for an improved infrastructure and facilities for the youth to leverage on as the economy bites harder. This was while donating a borehole to a community in Ogun State. Um, our main focus is to get the youth out of the streets. We want to empower youths. We know that um, there are many who, due to financial constraints, they couldn't attend training, um, um, technical schools, or your average uh, mainstream education. So we come together um, with diverse, mainly Shagamites, people from, from Shagamu, we live abroad and in Shagamu and in Nigeria as, you know, as a whole. We come together and we decide what can we do to help, you know, alleviate this, to help support parents who cannot afford to train their children. Um, you can say, we can say the government, where the government are not, you know, living up to their expectation. So we um, started this um, vocational training uh, last year um, and we had, a, we advertised for youths who are interested in those vocations I mentioned earlier, fashion designing, barbering. And yes, just so that uh, this is a way to empower them to keep them out of the streets. Just for them to do what they, you know, love and enjoy doing. Apart from what we are doing here today, we are also doing a lot of things in the community. Uh, your team have been to the ball centers that we have drilled for the people and in Pano, that people are already using uh, the ball and then we are doing another one very close to the um, junction there. So we are encouraging other people to join. Um, what we are doing here should be something government should be doing and, and that is why come 2023 Nigerians should vote right for purposeful leadership that will help the people. My colleagues, I'm saying a very big thank you to SDF Forum International. May God continue to uh, uplift them. Greater heights is what I pray for them. Firstly, I want to say thank you to SDF for actually empowering this one. Instead of having the multitude of girls that are outside doing prostitutions and all that, they were able to bring this one in for training. Actually, I would say we have to do reorientation. We have to bring people in to come and speak to them and talk to them and make them to understand that it's better to have something doing. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.